How does our service work? We begin with the family tree you provided to us. In this case, our client's name was Kelly Kraft. When she was a little girl, her maternal grandfather, Charles Albert Reed Jr., always told her they descended from an important family who had a coat of arms. She's wondered about it ever since. Was he correct? Let's find out. Let's begin with his father, or your great-grandfather, Charles Albert Reed, born in 1839. While conducting our research, we found an excerpt about him in a book titled Matthew's American Armory and Blue Book, published in 1908. According to this book, Charles was a prominent citizen in Massachusetts who used the following coat of arms informally during the latter part of the 19th century. Gules, a saltire between four garbs, or, which is heraldry speak for, a red shield with four yellow garbs between a yellow diagonal cross. But the question remains, was Charles using an authentic historical coat of arms that was owned by his, or our, ancestors? Let's investigate further. You provided us with your family tree up to William Reed, your eighth great-grandfather, who was born in England in the year 1601. We spent some additional time researching your lineage and were able to get back several more generations. We identified William's father as Thomas Reed, who was born in Barton Court in Berkshire, England, around the year 1565 AD. We also found this Thomas Reed mentioned in a book titled Genealogical and Personal Memoirs Relating to the Families of Boston and Eastern Massachusetts, Volume 3, by William Richard Cutter, published in 1910. According to this source, Thomas's father was Thomas Reed, your 10th great-grandfather, who married Mary Stonehouse and died in 1604. We researched this Thomas Reed further and found him described in a book titled A Record of the Reeds of Barton Court, Berkshire, by Compton Reed, published in 1899. According to this source, Thomas Reed was granted a coat of arms by William Camden, King of Arms, in 1597. It is blazoned as follows, Gules Saltire Between Four Garbs. This matches the coat of arms shown under your great-grandfather's name in the previously mentioned Matthew's Armory and Blue Book. So it turns out your ancestors did own a coat of arms after all. Your grandfather was right. Mystery solved. Further corroboration can be found in a source titled The General Armory of England, Scotland, Ireland, and Wales by Bernard Burke, published in 1884. It shows the same blazon, Gules a saltire between four garbs, or listed under the Reed surname, annotated as being found in Barton, County Berkshire. So what does Gules, saltire between four garbs, look like? A red shield with four yellow garbs between a yellow cross. The crest is a falcon rising belled and jest or on a tree stump vert. The family motto is Cadant Arma Togai, which is Latin and roughly translates into English as, may war give way to peace. So what will you receive? A brief one to two page report that contains all pertinent information and cites sources. So what can you do with this report? Bring this new discovered information to the next family reunion to impress your aunts, uncles, and cousins. Have a wedding in the family coming up? Include this information on a personalized wedding decor to impress all your guests with your family's proud history. Use it to help your kids with school presentations and projects. It's also a great way to get your grandchildren interested in history and their family's heritage. Get started today.